Hello everyone, today I want to talk about the new Kappa redesign. In this weekly update, we finally got the long-awaited Kappa redesign. The Kappa redesign looks a little bit like this. I'll put a photo on the screen now. This honestly looks 10 times better. The patch notes read, Kappas can now choose between a variety of different masks and horns during character creation at the barber. Masks and horns can be mixed and matched separately to each other. The old Kappa mask is still available and has been tweaked to match the new better style, but you're no longer forced to hide your face as a Kappa. Capra faces has also been redesigned to give an abated selection. Big thanks to both Pseudomesh and the Toons for providing feedback and sketches on the development of this redesign, as well as all the feedback received in the community. Pretty much they're just saying, they've redesigned the mask, the face, everything. This is a big change for Capras as they used to look honestly horrible. It was insanely ugly and I don't think a single person could have said they liked the Capra mask. So I'm really happy they finally reworked it. Now the next thing I want to talk about is Capra Mark talents. So the update reads, Kappa Mark talents now grind all of each other's bonuses, but are each better at their own respective trait. All the Marks now have equal HP regen, and Mark of Ku now grants improved blood regen. Ku and Nemet now get sanity protection, and Jurek and Ku now get improved food and water. So pretty much this just means the innate talents for Capra have now been kind of modified, so they all have the effect of each other, but one is better than the others. Anyways, that's all I have to talk about today. Please subscribe so we can get 2,000 subscribers. I'm really happy they added this finally. This has been a long awaited change for me. That's all for me, and have a good one.